Hi friends, Miss Amanda here from Cardiff Busy Bee Preschool and today I'm going to read Pig the Pug. Now I've already read Pig the Grub and Pig the Fibber but I realised I hadn't read Pig the Pug so I managed to get a copy of it and I thought we'd read that today. So then you've read all three and you know where Pig the Pug started. It is by Aaron Blady and it is published by Scholastic. And that is Pig the Pug. And it says, this book belongs to Pig. That is Pig. Pig was a pug and I'm sorry to say he was greedy and selfish in most every way. Oh dear. Show you the pictures. He lived in a flat with a sausage dog, Trevor. But when he when was he nice to him? I'll tell you, never. He was never nice to Trevor. Well, that's that's very mean. You've got some great toys there, poor Trevor would say. So Trevor wants to play by the looks of it. But Pig would just grumble. They're mine. Go away. Well, that's very rude and not very nice, is it? But it might be more fun, said Trevor to Pig, if we both played together. See, he wants to play. He really wants to play. Well, Pig flipped his wig. Uh-oh. He doesn't want to play with Trevor, does he? No, they're mine. Are you deaf? Only mine. You keep your paws off them, you sausage-shaped swine. That's really rude. I know what your game is. You want me to share, but I'll never do that. I won't and I swear. Wow. There he is yelling at Trevor. He's not very nice. I wouldn't want to play with him, I tell you that. I'd rather go and play with Trevor. And with that, he proceeded to gather his stuff and make a big pile with a huff and a puff. There he is. Trevor's watching. And he won't let Trevor play. There he is again. And once he had gathered them up in a pile, he howled from the top with a satisfied smile. There, shouted Pig, now you won't get my loot. It's mine, 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 mine. So why don't you scoot? <sighs> How rude. Poor Trevor. I'm not liking Pig very much at the moment. But just at that moment, poor Trevor did see the pile was wobbling. Oh, dear me. Watch out up there, good Trevor did cry. But the shame of it was, there's Trevor, there's Pig. It's about to fall. Well, pigs cannot fly. Oh, where did he go? He fell out the window. Oh dear. These days it's different, I'm happy to say. It's so very different in most every way. Oh look, Trevor's got some toys to play with. Looks like they're pig's toys. Why has he got toys to play with? Let's see. Yes, pig shares his toys now and Trevor's his friend and they both play together. There we go, they both play together. Why? <gasps> While pig's on the mend, look. Pig's got his whole body in a cast because he hurt himself when he fell out the window. And look, Trevor's helping him up. So Trevor's very nice and Pig was really mean, really mean and didn't want to share or play with Trevor. So, yeah, that's what happens when you do the wrong thing. You can hurt yourself. Luckily, Trevor was a good friend 
and is now helping pig. So it's always good to be nice to your friends or nice to um, just people in general because things things can happen to you and they won't help you otherwise. Okay. Anyway, that was a good story and I will see you next time. Bye.